I join you keenly aware that I am regarded in a different light now than I was a year ago when President Nikias and Jane Harmon kindly invited me to speak at this event. I'm also keenly aware that the reason for my recent journey was my own doing. So please allow me to begin my remarks this evening by reiterating how deeply I regret and apologize for the circumstances that led to my resignation from the CIA and caused such pain for my family, friends, and supporters. But perhaps my experience can be instructive to others who stumble or indeed fall as far as I did. One learns, after all, that life doesn't stop with such a mistake. It can and must go on. And the effort to move forward over the rocky path of one's own making is vital, inescapable, and ultimately worth it. I know that I can never fully assuage the pain that I inflicted on those closest to me and on a number of others. I can, however, try to move forward in a manner that is consistent to the values with which I, to which I subscribe before slipping my moorings and as best possible to make amends to those I have hurt and let down, and that is what I will strive to do.